हेलो फ्रेंड्स सो इन दिस रूट ट्यूटोरियल आई विल टॉक अबाउट हाउ टू सुपर इम्पोज मल्टीपल हिस्टोग्राम्स यूजिंग द टी ब्राउजर आई विल नॉट यूज एनी कमांड टू सुपर इम्पोज द हिस्टोग्राम बट आई विल यूज द ब्राउजर टू सुपर इम्पोज द हिस्टोग्राम सो लेट्स फर्स्ट सी आई हैव द फाइव रूट फाइल्स डी सी ए वन डॉट टू टी सी ए टू डॉट टू टी सी ए थ्री फोर एंड फाइव एंड देन आई कैन ओपन एट द टाइम बाई यूजिंग रूट माइनस एल स्टार डॉट रूट and then it will open all the root files so then you can draw, check in side the root file dcxy each root file has a one histogram you can clearly see that and then if i want to draw this histogram here then i can simply click here and then it will draw uh, the histogram in this region but i want to draw on a new canvas then you can select from file new canvas and then you can click on this then it you can see that the histogram is drawn here and then you can again select the new canvas and you can draw this histogram on this canvas and then you can also select the options for example if you want to draw the text option then you can select and then it you can see that the each bin has a text entry and then you can again select the new canvas and then you can draw the third but we can remove the text entry option if you want okay now it's removed and then you can select again a new t canvas and then you can draw the another options let's see another histogram also so here it will be it will draw another histogram so that way you can draw multiple histogram if you don't want to select any new canvas then it will draw here so in that case you can also update it you can also draw in this region if you want if you don't select a new tube browser then it will draw in this region also so now i will also show how how to superimpose uh, these histograms without using any command i will use only root uh, this browser so let's uh, now superimpose the histogram so in that case i will try i will choose a new t canvas okay now i will superimpose all the histograms here with the legend also so what i will do here i will click on the same so when you superimpose multiple histogram you do the draw same option so let's see okay now you can just click on this histogram now you can see this histogram is drawn here now because we choose the option same so each histogram will be drawn on this so now you we can also change the color let's say view editor and then we can change the line color red for the histogram 1 and then for the histogram 2 we can again superimpose okay now we can change the color also for this histogram let's make it blue and then we can select again third one and we can change the color let's say magenta okay and then we can again select the histogram 4 and then histogram 4 is drawn and then you can select the other options let's say this one and then you can again draw histogram here and then you can again change the color let's uh, move it blue no no we don't want this one so we can choose the color let's say this one okay or we modify the color you can choose uh, the color of your choice let's say green so now we have to do the this also modify i think we can change it to black if you want no just the white okay we can select and then we can just change the black okay so now what you can do since we i have drawn several histograms so uh, on the same histo same pack so now it's a superimposition of the all the histograms so now you can also give the type 
uh, the legend so for that what you can click you can click on this in this area and then you can say boot legend okay so now you can clearly see uh, because my Instagram name is same if your Instagram name is different then it will appear as a different name if your Instagram let's say if you write it DCA1, DCA2, DCA3, DCA4 and DCA5 then it will appear with that name but I since I put the same name so I have a, I am getting the same name but if, you, if I can again uh, modify the name here so what you can do here so we can do here set entry level okay so we can modify it let's say dca1 okay so it's modified the blue one so and then you can also change according to your choice set entry level dca2 2 and uh, you can also change the other one set entry level dca3 set entry level dca4 dca4 4 and the set entry level DCA 5. 5 now you can clearly see here uh, the legend also and you can change the dimension you want to put where you can put here also so that way you can basically uh, so for import the histogram you can again remove this entry if you want to change this entry you can also change the name you have to click on this histogram in this region on the histogram then you can modify super import import this one dca so that means you can easily super import the histogram by using the uh, t browser so thank you